YouTube was good, man. Metro Duma here. Ha, back again, dog. I've been in my A. Oh, yeah. Yeah, hey, I just want to sit here and talk to y'all, dog. Just be a fucking person for once. Well, I'm always a person. But yeah, and just being a human being, dog. Talk to you guys. Um, Shit. I've been in my A. I ain't upload. I mean, it is what it is. I'm coming back. I ain't gone. I just needed a break. It was late December. You know, I ain't seen fam since uh what we had Thanksgiving. But then, you know, well, you don't know. But I had to go see fam for a little bit. And I come back. And then we have Christmas break. Went OD on the uploads until about the end of December. And then I just kind of took a break, man. Had to regroup, had to re get my mind right, bro. It's a new year. It's been damn near a month. But I'm back. Shit, you know, hey. If you ever, you know, upload stuff or just a creator yourself, this shit is draining. But you always got to remember the purpose behind what you do or you know, the reasoning of why you're doing it, you know, and sometimes you just got to recharge, man. You have to, you just got to recharge, but you can't slack off too much, but it, it, the stuff's draining. It can drain your life force, dog. I'm telling you like, oh my God. I mean, you guys been here for the, <laughs> the adventures. You've seen all the stuff we've covered, you know, we can go on and on, but yeah, it's just, this shit's hard, man. It gets to you. You know, come home, especially if you, you know, you by yourself all the time. You come home, you just, you get, you focus off, take your mind off work. You try to come home and focus on the other job, you know. But anyway, it's just, hey, we, we need you guys, you know, just talking to everybody that fucks with us. We need you guys, you know, if you choose to, you know, if you choose to indulge and engage, with what we put out there, whether it's competitive related, uh, in real life, or if we cover the closed groups, the cheaters, this stuff, whether that we cover, it will always have a message, a meaning or something behind it. We're not just putting this up here. You know, this is not just for entertainment purposes and, you know, just to make fun of things or people, because that's not what we're here for. We're not here, you know, it's funny. Some things are just funny. Well, come on. But the whole point is we're here to compete. We want to compete, you know, but there's all these obstacles in our way, in other people's way, like that we just have to overcome and we have to figure it out. But we need we need your guys' help. We need your help. We need your support, you know. We just need it all. Uh, just even for examples, it's like I say it's draining or that the stuff that what we're trying to do is hard. Like imagine you, you know, like you're younger. You're like, man, I want to compete. You probably get into some game battles and everything, you know, as a younger teen, you know, get a couple trophies, win some matches, lose some matches, place in a tournament blah 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 you got a whole bunch of gb trophies you know like, oh, okay this stuff's cool i wonder what lands like you try to get to lands you know and you find out that something you've been wanting to do since you were you know however old or whatever is one of the you know it's just like it's not what you expected you know, it's the biggest reality slap doses that you can ever get you know you just you find out that damn this is not what i thought it would be but that's where we come in and we just have to have to overcome it, you know, to build it in layman's terms. We just have to, we have to be, you know, you find out that competition that can be, well, is competition actually staged? Is it fixed? You know, like it kind of does something to you. It's like something snatched out of you. I wouldn't say your soul, but. 
you know everything is just not what it turned out to be and then like go back to just to reiterate the gbs you know if you used to play game battles or the umg or cmg or what whatever all of them you know how many people on there are already doing stuff you know people are you already know if you competed online you already know people were doing the most the most petty stuff for roof whether it's clips and all that and the refs will always you know sometimes kind of side with the opposing team and you're just like dude he clearly broke this rule why is this not proof you know but i don't know it's always been some weird shenanigans when it comes to competing in in just i guess you could say esports i want online fps you can just say fps it's always been some weird stuff going on man but i mean hold on let me uh bring this up just just to reiterate this so i was talking uh i don't even want to get into this but i was i saw some on twitter one day and i was like yo what is this and there's something that caps lock caps lock had posted i like how people are surprised about the game battle situation anyone that plays on gb cmg or umg know this shit been going on for years you can always tell which teams are friends with an admin they will have almost zero losses on record and i proceed to say yo what happened and yes this bs has been going on for years on comp sites granted because i've played peep my recent tweet gb a gb admin got caught hooking up someone with cheats like how is this even a thing, bro? Like, let me. So, I think I went and looked it up. Here's the tweet: Something to keep in mind about the game battles admin who was offering cheats to a player recently at Blizzard Entertainment at Activision owns game battles. I did not know that, so this is new info to me. But anyway, beside point. A little FYI. For those who don't know much about the competitive side of the COD scene, looks like he goes up to show some screenshots here. Uh, I'm not sure who these guys are. Well, let's read the DMs. Ryan, we need you, buddy. We need your help to we need to or we need your help to help Lezer set up hacks on PC. He's been playing on whoa. He's been playing on PC, but we need hacks for him. We have money. Let me know. Oh shit. Systemcheats.net is the number one trusted distributor that updates fast. I can help tomorrow, but if he wants to fuck with it himself, he can go to that website, sign up, buy the premium package because they don't list COD as a standalone cheat unless they change that and then download the loader. That's it. Bruh. You can't tell me comp is not chalk. Why is the GB admin who is owned by Activision Blizzard? Now I have to go actually background look that up. But if what Caps Lock is saying is true, that Blizzard and Activision own game battles, why is an admin that is working for them or for that entity, that government or not government, but that company, enterprise, whatever, is giving players cheats? this is the issue and this is what we're up against and this is just one part of it we want to beat this we need to beat this everything needs the whole community everything needs a reform but that's going to start with me and that's going to start with you all of us and i'm dead serious man I want shit to change. I want everybody to actually have fun. I want the hackers to actually enjoy the game so they can just stop hacking. There's like, oh, this game's fun. I don't even need to hack. Like, but in order to get there, we might have to take, you know, a couple extreme measures, and, you know, say some things, whatever. But we need y'all support. We got to do it from within. You know? That's all we can keep asking for. We'll keep trying to do the best that we can. And I'll keep trying to do the best that I can. But holy shit, dog. I didn't even read this until now. 
a little FYI. Man. They don't directly own it. Okay, okay. Caps Lock explains. Huh? Good thing I scrolled down. They don't directly own it, but at Blizzard owns Major League Gaming, which owns Game Battles. So it owns it through a company it owns. However, is it really that much different? That's a good question, Caps. That's an actually good question. <laughs> you know, is it really that much different? No, not really. Not really, man. But we are just, whew. Yeah. We are up against the machine, brother. We are up against the machine. But anyway. Yeah, dog, that shit is it's disheartening, you know, especially since we finally had got a new team made. We just wanted just wanted a fair shot at doing this. But, you know, guess we had to take a different route. We ain't done, but we just got to do it a different way. So figuring out where to go from here. Like I said, I'm sorry if I just repeat myself, I'm just recording i'm not doing no editing to this figuring out where we go from here you know even if i'm consistent there is no guarantee that what we're trying to do will work i'm just happy i found a group of guys that are willing to do whatever it takes by all means necessary hmm. you know we're not even worried about the trolls our core audience is our main concern when it comes to the algorithmic algorithmic rat race <laughs> We can actually help each other, and that means I'm talking to you guys. We need to be able to help each other, you know, but, man. Another thing, why are we considered the dirty sector? I, I'm really trying to figure that out. Like, why are we considered the dirty sector, man? Why? Because we're actually calling stuff out, like, call, calling out all the abnormality, abnormalities that we see, like, Bro, we weren't born yesterday. You know, call it how we see it. You know, this stuff's playing out weird. Games playing weird. People are doing weird things in games. We've been playing a long time. None of this stuff is new besides whatever hacks and stuff that they update. But come on, once you once you've been playing for a while, you understand the way things work. Oh yeah, man. Oh no. We just gonna keep it rolling though. We're gonna keep it rolling, man. Like I said, this stuff's hard, but I'm back. We're back. Never left, but we just got to get to it. Being a content creator is... Hmm, I didn't even want to be a content creator. I'm going to just be for real, but it's not easy. You know, especially when you're working a uh, normal job on top of that. Uh, in essence, it's the second job. Like, literally, it's the second job. You know, we have one editor you know, and we would like to have a few more so we can actually start paying guys eventually, you know, for helping us establish something for you guys. But we got to have something to stand on. And just me being honest with myself, like I could pump out way more videos and be more uh consistent not a problem but it's just going to be at the cost of production quality because i'm i can edit but it's very time consuming and i just don't have that time so my videos will be out but they just they won't be to how i want them because normally if i if like my videos are edited i'm doing the editing Unless I really can't, then I will pass it over to Ali and speak on the ideas or the how I want certain things to look or flow when it comes to a certain video. But I'll still do the best I can. Moving forward, just want to say I appreciate all you guys that watch us. And this is a serious note. Like, I'm not, I'm not trying to be funny. Like, appreciate all you guys that actually come and listen, sit down, possibly learn something from us just talking. You know, we appreciate that y'all like the whole combos 
in the lives outside of the lives whether it's on discord or a personal or a dm whatever you know and if you see any type of info or a topic or something that we might have missed don't hesitate to reach out send it to us be like hey yo check this out check out this video because uh you know we'll cover it as long as we're not just <laughs> reporting like it's the news or something you know but yeah i was just not trying to fall down that route of like this is not for i guess it could be for entertainment but we're not entertainers this is not for entertainment like this is trying to spark a change and it's got to start somewhere so with that being said man i'll catch y'all on the next one that's just me catching up with you guys uh just being transparent on why i've been slacking but it's time to get back to it, man. I'll catch you on the next video. Peace.